हेलो फ्रेंड्स टुडे इन दिस ट्यूटोरियल आई विल बी टॉकिंग अबाउट ए नोट जेस मॉड्यूल व्हिच इज यूज्ड टू कन्वर्ट जेपीजी इमेजेस एंड पीएनजी इमेजेस इनटू वेबपी फॉर्मेट सो दिस इज द नेम ऑफ द मॉड्यूल शार्प सो इन ऑर्डर टू इंस्टॉल दिस मॉड्यूल इट इज वेरी सिंपल जस्ट एक्सिक्यूट दिस कमांड npm install sharp दिस विल इंस्टॉल योर मॉड्यूल आई हैव ऑलरेडी इंस्टॉल्ड दिस मॉड्यूल सो जस्ट गो टू योर index.js फाइल फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल यू जस्ट नीड टू इंपोर्ट दिस मॉड्यूल सो import this require sharp and now i will be converting this png file into webp format so in order to convert this file we will be using a example here you can see that this is a sharp function first of all you just need to call this function sharp here you just need to provide your image path it is located in images slash output dot png and then you can just bind some methods here chain some methods if you want to rotate it you can just call the rotate method if you want to resize it you can call the resize and provide the width as 200 let's suppose and the next method in order to convert it to a file uh, let's suppose i wanted to convert to output webp this is the extension so first of all it will rotate the image then it will resize it and then it will convert to output.webpack this is a file and you can also catch in the promise way you can just have the data here you can just console log the data if you want to catch any sort of error you can just catch it with this catch block and print out any kind of error so this is a code guys so now if i just uh, run this application by executing the command which is uh, node index.js so hopefully it will create this file which is you will see that it has created this file output.webp file and this is the result this is the format the width is changed to 200 because we provided this width as 200 here in the resize function and the various other the size is re reduced to you can see that 1466 bytes So in this way you can just use this module convert your images into web webp format so you can just read the documentation some more examples are also there you can even convert your svg images also to this webp format